We're now on my back porch. This is Lieutenant Dan. She is missing a back foot. And she gets around. I'm gonna try to find a worm. I'm almost out of worms, guys. I probably have maybe one or two left in this container. I'm just trying to find one. So I can throw it to her so you can see. She gets around pretty good. There's one. She doesn't. She did already. Oh, I got a chance to throw it out there, but there's a bug. She got the bug. That back right foot is missing. So she gets around pretty good. Lieutenant Dan. She doesn't really like to be picked up. Every time I go to grab her, she runs. And when I do get her, she pees on me. She's just not really... She'll tend to be a little bit more friendly than when she sees us, but right now she's not. Over there. She gets spooked easy. You see that? The front worms in their front porch, or the front toads, they really eat a lot. And so, because there's about 10 of them, and each one could easily eat 10. probably go through a thousand worms a week. We need to start making our own worm farm and growing our own because I'm always at the pet store. I used to do wa wax worms but they have more dead ones than alive ones and that's no bueno when you're paying for them. So The mealworms seem to do pretty good. Uh, not sure there it is. She got it. I'm gonna try to catch her. Oh, yeah, she is fast and she knows that I'm trying to get her. I don't have any fat worms left, so all the ones I have left are hiding in this sand. They're really skinny and small. Maybe I had to find to give to her. There's a shelter around and get it. See? The worm doesn't move. She will not come for it. It's moving ever so slightly. Oh, 
There she goes. Alright, so that's Lieutenant Dan. She likes to live under my patio furniture here. You can find her out here anywhere on this porch. But mostly she hides under it so that she doesn't get picked up by anybody. I have two big dogs that like to give her a sniff when they come out to go potty. So she's very used to running. Nope, she's like, nope, thanks. Okay, good night, Lieutenant Dan.